you have seen um, uh, India, Japan, um, uh, France, uh, Canada now, uh, Southeast Asia, Singapore, uh, speak up about the importance of investing in sovereign AI capabilities. Uh, it is, is uh, become abundantly clear to each one of the countries that that their natural resource, which is the data of their country, uh, should be should be um, refined and produce intelligence of their country for their country, and that capability of refining the data of their country of their country and turn it into their artificial intelligence it is now possible in a in a quite a quite a democratized way. Almost every country should be able to do it for themselves. And and um, what's needed, of course. Uh, is the technology and the know-how of standing up AI infrastructure. And that's where we could be uh, quite helpful to, to um, uh, various regions. And so I think that the, the recognition of the importance of sovereign AI capabilities is now uh, quite, quite global. Jensen, does that recognition and, and your ability to help extend to China? Well, we're an American company and we have to comply with American policies. And um, whatever the rules and regulations are and the laws are, uh, will number one comply with that uh, work closely with the regulators uh, and uh, understand understand uh, their intentions and their desires uh, work within those boundaries uh, and uh, be able to create products for for uh, the various countries that that uh, are involved fully in compliant with the regulations that that are uh, that are in front of us uh, and beyond that uh, once we once we comply uh, our goal are, are and the united states would love to see us be a successful country, and, and, and one of the pillars of national security is successful industries, and uh, it creates jobs um, uh, and uh, uh, allows our country to stay ahead and technologically. And so, uh, it, it is of, of uh, great interest of our nation uh, that our American companies are successful around the world. And so, once once we comply with the regulations, uh, we'll do our best to serve uh, the, the local markets. Artificial intelligence or the automation, uh, the production at scale of, of intelligence um, matters to every single country and matters to every single industry. And so for the very first time, there's a, there's a whole new computer market that is going to be uh, in, in every single country and every single, every single market. And um, uh, it, it, starts with, it starts with, of course, uh, uh, the, the native computer industry itself. Uh, but you're seeing you're seeing a great adoption in healthcare, great adoption in logistics, um, uh, in uh, in transportation, of course, uh, in manufacturing, in the large industries, the heavy industries. Uh, for the very first time, because of generative AI, computers are going to be computer technology is going to impact uh, literally every single industry in every single country, and so so the markets are going to be quite large and global.